about this kid. I hear you well, I'm, sure, I'm sure we'll get into that. Believe me, we'll get into that. He's got a tremendous history. Oh, Absolutely. Barry Rice taking a microphone. Hi, so here's the deal. I've been coming to 3XW for a lot of months now, and every time I come through the curtain, I get a mixed reaction. Some people cheer for me, some people boo me. What makes me think that you people don't understand who I am or what I went through, so let me enlighten you. My name is Barry Wright and I am a cancer survivor. Thank you, thank you, thank you, but I do not need your applause. What I need is your money. What is this? Got the jacket on again, I apologize. I love it. It's one bad jacket right there. All funniness aside, this should be a tremendous technical contest. A real good striking battle, and I expect in this one. Barry Wright is very motivated. He has yet to pick up a one-on-one -on -one victory here at 3X Wrestling. He has looked great in all his competitions. Well, I don't know about that, but he certainly won me over tonight. That uh, kid's got spunk. <laughs> Uh, he's right. He, when he, he came canceled. into 3X Wrestling, he was a true fan see. favorite, was even teaming with Ray Stryker for a time, but this is a real vicious side we've seen as of late of Barry Wright. Started with that low blow on Tyler Cook in Ottumwa, Iowa. And an interesting contest with Jimmy Rockwell, last night in Grimes, Iowa. Well, and he's got a point. I mean, should guys like Tyler Cook and Jimmy Rockwell be trying to beat up a cancer survivor? I so much. I know. They should show him some respect. He's currently in remission for non-Hodgkin's lymphoma cancer. But, I mean, you have to give him credit for even getting into the ring. Absolutely. The guy's a warrior. You know, last night but I wasn't on his side, but tonight he's won me over. But he knows what he's getting into as a professional athlete, and you can't put that on his opponents in the ring. Really, if anything, uh, it could help him as a psychological advantage that his opponent might worry about injury a guy in his medical situation. Or... What was a very good situation? It's right away. Strife goes to work on the left arm of right. That was kind of funny. Strife currently is quite a rivalry with Ben Saylor, our for current 3 x wrestling champion. As it was Strife, the runner-up in the gauntlet for the Gold Battle Royal, he was entrant number four in the 30-man Battle Royal. Ben Saylor, number three, eliminated Strife to win the match. Strife thought he had already eliminated Saylor. An unfortunate break for him. The crowd's already behind Jason Strife. You can't be surprised after that uh, introduction by Barry Wright. I think these people need to stand up and praise Barry Wright. I'm very sorry to hear that. Well, if Barry Wright yeah. picks up the win here tonight, that is huge for him. That elevates him immediately up the rank and hurts Strife's opportunities to possibly get that heavyweight title shot with that save. Nice side headlock here. Saw Strife go down to one knee to help his own leverage on the hole. Innovator move there by uh, Wright to back up into the rope to get out of that one. Absolutely. The kid's smart. One thing to watch for all evening here is it is 90 degrees outside. These guys are wrestling on black canvas. The sun is beating down. There's no shade to be found around the ringside area. We're fortunate There's that we're no shade to be found here either. Really. <laughs> we're fortunate that we're at least under a staging ring. Uh, if you see me on camera at any point, walk five feet to my left. That's because there's better shade if I stand up. Well, I've at least Paul, got a you're kind of on your own on that one. It's okay. You left me out in the sun to burn last night, and I'm happy to give it I thought you could put some sunscreen. Fair skin, buddy. It didn't help. Hey, I got him! Hey, right says he's got him. He's got him in a nice side headlock. 
Strife. You know, the way Wright had that position, Strife. Oh, now come on! Oh, yeah. Speaking of positioning, Wright used all the positioning of the referee there. Quite frankly, he used the rope like that. That's not an illegal hold. Or move, I should say. Nice drop. Wow! Nice kick there by Jason Strife. Set her up with that drop down. Trip. It's right over the outside. They're on gravel out there. Oh yeah, there's that is not a landing zone by any means. Not a safe one. Yeah, sure. I, I know I don't think Strife wants to be falling out there. Strife up and over. Oh, oh boy. Right ducks. He thinks he got out of this. Watch out. Oh what a kick! Oh, kick Good great. Straight in the mouth. Right in the nose. Stay like a little girl. Strife could uh, kick for the Iowa Barnstormers with kicks like that. Vicious back rake. Right. Vicious back rake. Right. Strife has been watching a lot of Hulk Hogan footage recently. A prime move used by Hulk in his top fan favorite period in the late 80s. Not sure what Wright was doing there. He just doubled back to Canvas. Nice flip there by Jason Strife. Nice cover. Smart move. And notice how Strife spread his own legs out to help put some more weight on the body of their right. Strife currently undefeated since November in 3 X Wrestling. What is this? Over half a year now. A master of four ways, three way matches. It's a great singles competition. Drop kick right to the kidney there. Good move. Another quick cover, smart strategy. As I'm sure these guys want to get out of this heat as quick as possible and get to a pay window. I want them to get out of here as quick as possible too, man. I'm <laughs> Body slam now. That's right. Buddha style elbow there. Uh, he's not going to be right with that. Very right is certainly a fighter. You know, the receiving end of a lot of punishment here in the early going. And strike, you know, he's, he's smaller by heavyweight standards, but his strikes are so devastating. He's got the technical wrestling, and he's by far the fastest athlete in 3XW. Look at this, Barry Wright, clubbing shots at the solar plexus. Oh, throws him down. Just like that, Barry Wright is taking control of this match. He uh, still needs to show a little more aggression here. He went and played to the crowd after that. That's not exactly, he's not, he's not winning over anybody tonight, so. I don't think he cares to. Sounds like he just wants their money. Him have a long and we do have a great crowd on hand here at Boone today. I don't know about a great crowd, but we've got a sizable crowd. Well, they seem like good folks. Folks is definitely what you used to describe people like. They had a lot of options in this city tonight, and they just had some great wrestling. So very proud to have everyone in I hear Bubba was running out of sheep tonight. What's that? Try fights back. I know we've got a wedding reception going on next door, and I've seen a number of people wandering outside to see what's going on. But this is probably the most memorable wedding reception any of those folks have ever been to. And sidewalk slam there by Barry Wright. But you're right, earlier in the evening we did have the bride and groom even taking photos inside the ring area. Consummating their marriage in the middle of the ring. Look at this move, Mary Wright. With a, is that a full Nelson? A, a surrounded full Nelson. What a move. Got him right in the center of the ring. Now he slid over to try to get a better position on his hands, but he gave Strife the opportunity to get a, a vertical base. Look at the strike! Now this is not the problem you should have picked up on that. I, I always had for sportsmanship, but turnabout is fair play. Wright did that to him earlier. Now is this the kid who became a referee because he won a carnival game last night? No, he's a trading official. I fish this man winning a carnival game last night. Oh, shoulder up by Barry Wright. Nice bridge there. Oh, come on, guys. I believe it was a guess your weight game. No, they they, they guess sanctions is a license. They guessed him at what 95 I mean, pounds. He's in his first or second year of officiating, but he's, he's qualified to officiate in the state of Iowa. Genius. 
We do have kind of a lax regulation. That's that flip, right, with his hands on the ropes. Oh, Pete Sanchez kicks him off. Good officiating there. That's, that's terrible. You can't get away with that. Come on. He's stuck with a wrestler. That's not... Oh! What a move! From a neck breaker position into a face buster. Spike strife on his head. This has become a real back and forth contest. Oh, look at your right was trying to go for that series of European ecstasy uppercuts. Kicks right, right in the face, go for the... Oh, right! has done his video scouting. He saw Strife coming with an EDT and avoided it. Unbelievable. Now a Boston Crab has been applied in the center of the ring. Uh, he needs to get that hooked in a little deeper. He doesn't have the leverage to beat him with this. I think if Wright sits down on it here, Strife will really be in trouble. As he does, he sits down a little more, I think. Oh, Strife has got the ropes, though. That was his own fault. He's got right till five to break the hole, and he releases it at the three. You gotta hook those legs deeper. You gotta sit down far than that. You're not gonna beat him on something like that. That did a lot of damage to Strife's back, though. We'll see how Wright capitalizes. Oh, Strife kicks off. Wright hits the corner hard. Up and over goes Strife. Oh, it's a Geary right to the back. He had him right in the shoulders. Strife goes up top. What a frog splash. Man, alive. And that will do it. Jason Strife, your winner. What a great opening contest here in Boob. Yeah, Barry Wright won me over at first, but he's going to need to be a little more aggressive in the ring for that. Great effort by Barry Wright. This didn't have enough tonight to pick up the victory over a very talented, one of the top stars of 3X Wrestling today, Jason Strife, the bulletproof tiger, Jason Strife. The other guys, they think they know what special means. At Godfather's Pizza, we do special, and we do it better. We add the T. There's a Godfather specialty pizza with your name on it. Classic combo, all meat combo, hot stuff, taco, yeah, even veggie and more. All of them piled high with the best toppings and 100% real cheese. Treat yourself special. Order specialty pizzas from Godfather's Pizza. Are you into WWE or 3X Wrestling? Then we have the place for you to hang out every Monday night and Sunday WWE pay-per-view events monthly. The Keg Stand in West Des Moines at 3530 West Town Parkway. Every Monday night you can hang out with 3X Wrestling staff and wrestlers while we watch Monday Night Raw. Plus the monthly WWE pay-per-view events including WrestleMania, Royal Rumble, SummerSlam and more. Friend 3X Wrestling and the Keg Stand on Facebook and we'll keep you updated. See you at the Keg Stand for wrestling, drinks and great food from Bach Catering. Ladies and gentlemen, approaching the ring, he stands at six feet tall and weighs in at 220 pounds from Cahoka, Missouri, all that from Murphy! Look at this. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I love it. Countryman. Todd Countryman back in action. What is Todd Andrew Countryman SW. doing out here? I agree. Shut up, Country. Sit down, shut your mouth. What is the deal here, Hollinger? Well, Todd Countryman has obviously opened up his wallet and, and brought in Matt Murphy. Well, Matt Murphy in his 3 x wrestling debut. He'll uh, one of the all-time greats here in the last, I'd say, 20 years in the Midwest. Absolutely. One of my favorites. And it looks like Todd Kutcher has found a new member of the of Genesis here in Matt Murphy. I didn't even know Todd Countryman was here tonight. None of the other Genesis members are on the card. But the commissioner of 3 extras and Todd Countryman always has something up his sleeve. And one thing for sure, he does not like that Jimmy Rockwell. This should be a phenomenal contest. He has a lot in common with, with me and most everyone else. Not many people like Jimmy Rockwell. But I'll tell you who I do like. I like Matt Murphy. Accompanying him to the ring, Todd Countryman.
Jimmy Rockwell, strong response from the crowd here at Boone. a great one-on-one -on -one contest. The first time meeting between perhaps one of the top young rising stars in the Midwest and one of the top veterans in the Midwest in Matt Murphy. choking away. Todd was giving him some water. He understands it's hard. It had to be a much harder fall to take than the traditional fall out of the ring. Not sure knows what it's like to fall out of this ring. He's just checking out Rockwell. He's, he's being kind of considered. But you got to watch for some, some lacerations there, too, because they're jagged rocks all over the uh, ground. This is literally ground side floor. Let's now watch. Forearm smash. Rockwell's back. Rockwell's with a lot of pieces of that gravel stuck to his back. Sunset flip. I think some of the gravel whipped off there. Henry Rockwell might want to watch his eyes. Oh, look at that. Big right hand. What a haymaker shot there. This match is all Matt Murphy now. Oh, what a shot. I can't believe Rockwell didn't fall all the way to the mat after that. Big chop there by Matt Murphy. Very pleased with himself after that. And I think Murphy is extra motivated to have here tonight with DiBiase in attendance. Had a number of tryouts with the WWE. He never got signed, and he's got a chip on his shoulder because of that. What a jab there! One shot. Rockwell goes out. Kick out at two. Hey, I don't think it makes sense. No, a rear chin lock has been applied there. 
maybe that's a rear naked chip. So look, Murphy originally using the no, what is not originally using that damage left arm switches before Rockwell can break hold of the move. He's tapping out, right? Right arm, very smart move by the veteran. He went over this last night, Gunner. That's a rear naked chip. Just a cousin to the rear naked. And a jawbreaker there by Jimmy Rockwell. Getting up itself is not legal in professional wrestling. Close line. Rocco's got all the momentum. Nice rock kick. Good execution right in the chest here. The local photographer might want to watch out here. He might become part of the action too. Oh! Charging knees. We've got press on hand. Some of the local newspapers. Oh! What a move there by Rockwell. Sets up a spinning heel kick. Big time news here. Oh. Now look at this. Now wait a minute. Crutchman just slid something into the hand of Matt Murphy. What are you talking about? Look at that. He's got something in his hand. Shut your mouth, Guthrie. Nothing happened. Man. He's got something in his hand. Oh, Jimmy right to the seat. Oh, blast him with the forward object. He's got a fist. He blasted the man with the forward object. Just knocked Jimmy Rockwell out. Oh, come on. Matt Murphy has picked up a victory, a big victory, over the rock star Jimmy Rockwell. Look at Murphy still has his hand closed. Oh, that's Matt Murphy! Now come on! He's, he's got it right there! It's in his head, he has something in his hand. He's got his hand in his hand. Ridiculous. So the crowd's let Matt Murphy have it. Oh! Listen to that, Hollinger! One of the most recognizable themes of Yes! The Million Dollar Man is here! So we're gonna see this crap again tonight. He's gonna come out, he's gonna stick his nose in things. Hall of Famer Ted DiBiase and Countryman and Murphy clearly confused, intimidated by this situation. Now you gotta wonder, Ted DiBiase has been watching these matches. I love the timing there though, it's maybe a... Uh... This guy had a foreign object, he gave it to him. Yeah! You need to, you need to... Need either reverse this decision or restart the match because this guy right here is a cheater. He is a cheater. Yes. I love the bluntness here. Let's not. Let's let's just get right to it. Oh, come! Oh, cut! Look at this. I can see it from here. I told you, guys. There's nothing going on here. Oh, he dropped it. There, it bounces right out of the ring. There, there was the evidence. Thank you, Ted DiBiase. If anyone knows about cheating in professional wrestling, you're looking at one of the top cheaters in the history of wrestling, the Million Dollar Man, and thank God he now is on a... Uh, he realizes he was going down the wrong path much of his career with that stuff. As you see, the match has been restarted. Sit out, Gord Buster. Million Dollar Dream on Todd Countryman. Oh, this is a disgrace. Murphy is down. Look at the Rockwell cannot believe what he's seeing right now. Murphy is out. Countryman is out. This is phenomenal. Oh, this is a joke, Guthrie. Ted DiBiase has no business sticking his nose in the Rock way. on Raw, what a move. Jimmy Rockwell, the official winner of this contest. This is absolutely disgusting. That's right, sportsmanship reigns supreme. What a shocker. What a weekend this has been to have Ted DiBiase coming to the aid of sportsmanship and Jimmy Rockwell and Ray Stryker. Ted DiBiase shoving his nose in other people's business is what's happening. This is disgusting. And it was not letting the MMA get away with anything last night. And here tonight, Todd Countryman and Matt Murphy have now lost, thanks to the keen eye of Ted DiBiase. Look at this. Oh, yes. Rockwell 
puts the money in the mouth, the million dollar man. Eddie, that's the what a tremendous moment. This makes me sick, Guthrie. Wrestling has events all over Iowa, and we want you there. Experience the on-site action, visit the 3XW store, and meet the wrestlers, including national and regional favorites, TNA wrestlers, WWF and WWE Hall of Famers, NWA champions, and of course the all-stars of 3X Wrestling. Hours of wrestling entertainment for $15 or less. Monthly TV tapings take place at the Baratas at Forte 3XW Coliseum in downtown Des Moines, the fourth Friday of every month, where doors open at 7 and bell time is 7.30. Check out 3XWrestling.com for more details and to sign up and find out when we're coming to your community. 3X Wrestling, you gotta be there.